All right, guys. Well, in this video, I'm going to uh, got some new mirrors for the Sonoma because yeah, the uh, the glass decided it uh, wanted to come out, um, and uh, I haven't been able to adjust this driver side mirror since I got it, and uh, come to find out. It's just been glued in, which is why I couldn't adjust it, and it uh, fell off when I was washing and waxing it one day at work. It decided to come off. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, you might notice this is a different design. That's because the 97 and back uh, to a, in the rounder body style, so it's like 94 to 97, whatever the newer body style is. <clears throat> has a different mirror than the 98 and up but the reason I got this mirror first of all is because it's cheap uh, first of all cheap second of all it's smooth it's not textured like the newer ones and uh, these are just temporary anyway like these are bottom of the barrel pretty much the cheapest that I found uh, they're all plastic they're kind of wobbly but this is temporary to get rid of the mirror that's taped on. I'm eventually going to step up and get some, uh, uh, I think they're street scene mirrors. They're uh, uh, electric conversion plus heated plus turn signal and all this other stuff. Uh, but those aren't cheap, so I got these temporary. And I'm also, as you see over here, got some adhesion promoter for plastic, base coat, and clear coat. I'm going to color match them. I was going to pay the guy at work, the painter, to actually paint these, but that would be like 10 times what I paid for these mirrors. Uh, I paid, uh, <laughs> I had a coupon, so I paid like 12 bucks for these things. Uh, the painting actually wasn't that expensive, uh, but considering these aren't permanent, I decided to go ahead and forego actually getting it professionally painted, and I'm just going to spray paint it. I already had this light, these laying around from when I did tail lights, um, and I just went and picked up those. I thought I had some high uh, grit sandpaper. I can't find it, so I'm just going to scuff it up with some 220. Uh, I would rather have some 2000 or something, but uh, it should cover up, and these are temporary. So, I'm going to go ahead and scuff these up, tape these up, and I'll start painting. Alright, here they are. All taped up, all scuffed up. All wiped off and, <clears throat> and all blown off. So, time to use adhesion promoter. So, I'll get on it. Alright guys, don't know how good you're going to hear me, but respirator... So, I already did the adhesion promoter, and this is all, I don't know, I did three or four, maybe five coats of base. So I'm just letting this dry before I do the clear coat, but I think it turned out pretty good. So, I'm going to let this dry probably 10 minutes. I'm going to double check and then do a clear coat. All right, fast forward a week and they're now on. Um, I let the clear coat dry for a couple days and then it was uh, slow at work this week. So, uh, I uh, just had them in the truck. So, I brought them in, did a quick uh, buff buff job with a uh, like a medium polish and a fine cut polish or buffing compound whatever you want to call it uh they're not perfect not perfect whatsoever it's a bunch of orange peel and uh but again like i said earlier in the video these were cheap bottom of the barrel mirror mirrors and uh they're not permanent these are a temporary solution because this mirror was broken and i needed something so uh, I decided to get these, and uh, 
painted myself because I didn't want to get them professionally painted again because they were cheap uh, the mirrors I'm eventually going to get are going to be like uh, I believe they're the street scene mirrors uh, they are conversion mirrors that will give me power and heated mirrors and stuff like that but uh, that's later on down the road I'll get those professionally painted and I'll also get the uh, the body kit uh, professionally painted uh, whenever I get the extreme body kit on it but anyway um, the color match is pretty good it's, uh, it's I don't know I call it like a five foot paint job it's rattle can it's online order color match it's fairly decent the camera I think washes it out a little more um, but the farther away you get the better it gets and if somebody gets up close and is looking at it and sees the color difference well again don't really care too much most of the orange peel is down at the bottom of the mirror still can't really tell I don't I think the passenger side one is the worst one but um, I just all I did is took this area right here basically and I buffed this really good did the bottom too but mainly did this so um, it still shines pretty good so that's all I really care about so and they function again it's what I care about so that's it for now and I'll talk to y'all later